All right, guys, welcome to another episode of Pokemon Masters. <coughs> Today, I wanted to be going over Houndoom slash Mega Houndoom. Kind of a showcase for today. Uh, again, I got lucky. I saved up the 3,000 gems and I unlocked a natural 5-star, which is a Karen Houndoom Sync Partners. Let's go over his uh, stats real quick on Houndoom, regular Houndoom. HP near 400, attack 223. Special attack 255. Uh, sorry, I said defense. Defense 117. Special defense also 117. Speed 240. Now, when he evolves to Mega Houndoom, defense becomes 128, which is an increase of 9. Not not a big deal. Special attack becomes 280 from 255. That's an uh, increase of 25. Yeah, 25 points. Speed gets the biggest boost from 240 to 287. Again, I'm not familiar with speed does in this game, so yeah. So pre Mega Evolution, regular Hondo has Bite, which does 42 damage. Uh, now that I think about it, it's better if I go like this. Yeah, when, when going over the moves, I'll be on this page. Bite, 42 damage, has a moderate chance of making the target flinch in case. You guys don't know that's like a stun for that turn. Snarl. Oh, also a uh, bite is a physical move, so it's good that Hondoom has uh, both physical points and special attack points because he has two types of attacks: bite being the physical and snarl, snarl being the special attack. Special attack. Uh, snarl does 39 points of damage, it's three less than bite, but it's special attack based, and it lowers the target's special attack. And um, the target is AOE, so you can hit all three enemies. So in the long run, Snarl has a lot more value in damage. Um, if it's down to the last unit, you probably want to bite uh, just for the chance of flint, flinch. But then you also have to consider Mega Hondo has more special attack. Dire hit sharply raises the user's critical hit rate. Entertain me. The lower the user's HP is, the more this move raises the user's special attack. Which is amazing when you're in Mega Houndoom. When your special attack is... Sorry. Ooh. There he is. Let's go up here. So Mega Houndoom, 280. Every time... Actually, I don't know what the increase is on that move. Because that's not... That type of... Um, Support item doesn't exist in a regular Pokemon game, so I don't know what's the percent increase compared to the percent of HP lost. So, special attack, which is the sync move, it has a really low base power compared to standard. Standard um, sync moves do 200 damage. This one's a special type, 160 damage to one opponent, and becomes Mega Houndoom until the end of battle. So, that's how you evolve in the middle of a battle. So far, this is the only Pokemon I think I have that can Mega Evolute. Mega Evolve. And then, when you Mega Evolve... How do I... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that's it. You lose... With a Biter Crunch. You lose Bite. But, you gain... Dark Pulse. A 95 base special attack. Has a small chance... 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 Chance of making the target flinch. Which is kind of like already bite, but uh, it's special attack based, meaning it's gonna do way more damage because of um, the stats being focused on special attack and the way how higher base power. So, actually, I wanna favorite that. Um, uh, my goal in this video is to showcase Mega Houndoom, and in order to do that, let's go to the hardest story map in the game. Which is actually chapter 18. Chapter 2 has nothing. I already completed this, this, the base game. Uh, challenge uh, Sharon. Sharon? I forget his name. Unfortunately, when you beat this team, you unlock Sharon. I would have preferred a Hilbert or Hilda, but they gave me Sharon. He did have a, um, a five star natural. Um, I forget that dog's name. 
It's a uh, normal typing and dark type, but I guess really in this game it's only dark type. So to make make a hound do evolve as fast as possible, I'm gonna try to go through the support items as much as possible. I gotta be quick, cause this team hits hard. There you go. That's the dog right there that, that you get. I'm actually gonna turn this down. I'm gonna activate as much entertaining special attacks as I can. I gotta start um, boosting, and I'll let uh, Lapras start getting the hits in. See, that did almost no damage. All right, now I can start. Um, I say I want to start activating dire hits too before I mega evolve. Get some X deeds in. I'm gonna evolve soon. All right, once these two support items are through. Also, when you make it evolve, oh yeah, I, I, I went over to the skill. When I make it evolve, I will get one hit in off. Hit in, hit off. All right, here we go. Make it evolve into Houndoom. And once I make it evolve, the damage is gonna start coming through. Let's go. Dark pulse. There you go. That's the seafood. There you go. That's the, that's what I want to see. One thousand three hundred. Oh, that was a big dark pulse on me. I mean, that was a big heat wave. I think. One thousand two hundred on a on a dark pulse. That's not even my sync move. I gotta start boosting myself up. He's gonna have to do the sync move soon. I'm just healing. He's he's gonna sync move me. Oh, he flinched! I flinched him on a sync move. The moment he comes out of that, though, I'm dead. There it goes. Oh, there it goes. That's... The thing about Portis Sequels is that they're AoE. It has a high chance of taking down my entire team. Please go for my Snivy. Snivy is my tankiest unit right now. That was actually really weak. Oh, but special attack down six. That is really, really bad. See, that went... That's half my damage. Oh no, that's not good. I am so slow. I need, I need to use the sync move. I think I might be dead right here. Yep, Mega Hunter's dead. The special thing about Lapis is um sync move. Is that if they're frozen, it deals extra damage, but unfortunately, I was not able to freeze them. Alright, he's gone. Trying to heal whatever I can. That's not very much. I'm gonna have to continue using blizzards. I am so slow still. Why does Heat Wave hit everything for so much? Oh my... No! Oh! I thought I was gonna lose the burn. I didn't even realize Snivy was still alive. Or Sne... Uh... Sneevile? I believe it's Sneevile right now. So yeah. That last stage in the game... That... This is, this is all that's released for now. It said that right now. This is the current content. We still have a lot more story mode. Because I still haven't won the... The league. Or uh, whatever this place is called. That was tough. So that's the hardest in um, story mode, but in the training area, there is these uh, super courses, the support super course, level up super course, strike super course, and I forget what the other one was, tech super course. Um, these are a lot harder to do if you don't have the proper weaknesses of en the enemies. Actually, this one just came up, huh? 
Yeah, these are just refreshed. It's got, it's got three attempts remaining. Because I already did all my attempts for the, for the day. Except this one. So, the super courses I could not complete, even with proper um, effectiveness. There was one super course I was able to complete, and I don't remember which one it was because it's now rotated off. As far as the other um, courses, the, the regular courses, those are all complete. Up to very hard. They're not that hard. The super courses are the ones that are actually very hard. So yeah, techs, level ups, uh, strike, they're all, they're all complete. Support. The only ones that are not complete yet are the super courses. That's pretty much all I wanted to showcase for today, guys. It was just a real quick showcasing of uh, Houndoom and Mega Houndoom at level 85. I still have to unlock their level 100, so they still got room to grow. Uh, for now, it's really hard to unlock the... Uh, I'm not sure what they're, qual they're called, but let me hop in there real quick. These. Gym Leader Notes. You could trade for them but they're really expensive they have a small chance to drop in the very hard super course and that's how I got my one copy but that um, super course has already ro rotated out hope you guys enjoyed today's showcase I did want to give you guys a sneak peek on next next showcase I want to do it's actually a three-star unit this one right here slacking let's check him out at level 20, 29, only three stars. That means his um, level cap is gonna be a lot lower than other units, cause I don't know why. The more stars you have, the higher your level cap. 156 uh, HP, 74 um, attack at level 29. Body slam, 53 uh, power, 100 accuracy. Moderate chance to leave the target paralyzed. X attack sharply raises the user's attack, and you can use it twice, so that's like almost 100% increase. His sync move. Now remember, Houndooms, Mega Houndooms was 300, uh, no, 160, and it did 1300 damage to the, uh, I forget that Pokemon's name, even though I just battled it. So 160, and it was not bad. This guy's got 300 power in, in his Giga Impact. His other moves are not too bad either. Double Edge, 167 power, 100% accuracy. But there's recoil. 25% of the damage I deal to them, I get back. All out effort though restores a bit of the user's HP, increases the user's move by uh, move gauge by two, and he also contains an X attack. So I think Slacking could really, you know, contend, could be a good contender against um, Lycanroc because Lycanroc is 400 um, HP. Almost 300 attack, and only does 250 to his power move. Only contains um, X attack, and now that I think about it, I forgot to check out Slacking's passive power reserve. Powers up a move in a pinch, even more power when he gets low on health. But anyways, that's today's video, guys. I just wanted to showcase the Mega Hound Doom. Can you can you believe you could pay however much it is for the one time roll guaranteed five star in paid gotcha or i get lucky two gotcha rolls tend to uh, multi, multi summons each time getting a five star pokemon i've been pretty lucky with this game this game is blessing me right now so i'm having fun with this all right guys i hope you guys enjoyed today's video really quick i really wanted to showcase the Doom, and then uh i probably should do a showcase for Lycan Rocks and Sound Doom was a special attacker and Lycan Rocks a, a physical attacker. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Leave a like, subscribe, and comment. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.